In this video, we are going to be looking at circular flow of income of three sector model. In our previous video, we've talked about circular flow of income of two sector model. Now, we want to talk about circular flow of income of three sector model. Now, in three sector model, we have three major participants. We have government, we have household, and we have uh, we also have uh, we have firms. You know, in two sector model, we have only firms and household. But now we have three major participants now: household, firms, and the government. Now, in three sector model. There is going to be government intervention. It means that there is going to be taxes and there is going to be government expenditure. Now, taxes will be in form of, uh, in, in, in form of drawer. That is leakages in an economy because it's taking the money away from the economy. And the government expenditure will now be in form of uh, injection into an economy. That is, the money taken away in, uh, in form of tax will be, you know, injected back in, in form of government expenditure. And how does money? Uh, expenditure that is how, how does uh, income flow in this particular you know uh, sector that is what we want to look at in the three sector model so in three sector model now we have a three major participants here we have in our we have in our firms we have firms firms then we have our household household then let's put it in sheet here Let's enclose it here. Let's enclose it here. So let's enclose it here. Now, now this is how it starts. Let's start from our normal household, you know, two-sector model. In two-sector model, you know, it's going to come this way. It's going to come this way. This, this supply will come from the household first. That is factors of production. Factors of production to the firms, to the firms, and firms will pay back. The work of factors production like this that is factor income, factor income. Don't forget our two sector model. We did it factor in that is work of factors production. So money is in the hand of household now. Then the household, what's going to happen to household now? Household here yeah, will be using the money for three things now. The first one is going to consume the goods produced here because the goods produced here will be supply, we supply supply to the household and household must pay back so this is uh this is uh, uh this is the product markets product market where the goods is sent to the uh, household then the household have to pay if you need to pay back if you need to pay back to the firm to pay back to the firm so when they pay back to the firm the firm here you know is going to have income now then this is the first way of spending money by the household. Bank, the more, all the money spent by the, the, the household now, then the, by the firms now, the household is now spending it back. The part of it will be to purchase the goods and services. The part of it will be for savings. For savings, let me just make it S. For savings. For savings. And from savings now to financial institution, financial institution, then the financial institution will send it back to the firm. Then send it back to the firm. Now, part of this income of factor income of the household will also be used as taxes. Taxes. Now the government, government is involved now. Taxes. I make it T. Taxes. 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 And that will be sent to government, you know, sector. That will be sent to government sector. GS. I make it GS, government sector. Now, when government sector get the money, the government sector will use it as government. The money is, is not, an, it's, it's not a withdrawal now. Tax is a withdrawal. Then the government needs to you know, inject the money back also. Meaning that the government needs to pay back the money that is here that government has received as tax. Because the tax will come from the household. To the government, even firms also, the firms also will also pay, you know, tax to, to to the government. You know, the tax from the firms will also come like this here to the government. You know, to the government here, we also come like this. We come like this to the government. So, government is receiving tax from two angles now, from the household and from the firms. But there must be a return for this. There must be a return. The government must also return back. It will also return back by purchasing from the firm. Purchasing from the firm. So when it purchases from the firm, 
then he's going to return part of what he has taken from the firm's back. Then the firm must also return back to back to the to to the to the household. Must also return back to the household. Return back to the household in forms of what? In forms of transfer payment. You know, transfer payment, social securities, palliative. The government must also pay back. So as government is getting the money as leakages from household, as leakages from FEMS, you must also pay the household back as transfer payment and palliative, you must also pay the 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 uh, the FEMS back in, in terms of purchasing goods and services from them, even doing good roads for them for easy, uh, for easy uh, transport of their goods and services and all of that. So as the money is coming into the hand of FEMS, FEMS sent it to the government, is sent it to the household. Then as money is getting to the house of household, household is getting to the setting to the firms, is also getting to the government. As money is getting to the, to the government, government is sending back to the firms, is also sending back to the household. That's how it's going to be moving in three sector model. Please subscribe and get more of our video.